Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. I'm Tyler Mount coming to you from Actors Connection and you're tuned in to the Tyler Mount vlog here on the Marquee Channel. My guest today is star of stage and screen and has appeared in such hits as St. Joan, An Act of God, Spring Awakening, Cyrano de Bergerac, and Spider-Man Turn Off the Dark and is currently electrifying the underworld eight times a week in Town on Broadway. Please welcome the one, the only, Tony nominee, Patrick Page. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. I love that it says that uh, you, you said that I uh, was in an act of God. That's on my resume. But in fact, I'm, I'm just the voice of God at the beginning. Did you get a Tony nomination for that role? I did. I you did didn't. Not. Okay. So that's, I would say that was the biggest snub of the year, but you've made it up this year. We have a lot to discuss. You're starring in the season's most critically acclaimed new musical, 14 nominations this week, the most of the season. I believe the fourth most nominations in the theatrical history. How does it feel to be recognized, not only personally, but as a show as a whole? It feels great. I mean, it, it, it feels better than great. Yeah. Because if you count an act of God, mm -hmm. <laughs> which apparently people do, this is my 15th Broadway show. So to be in something that has really caught the imagination of everyone in town is, uh, is really gratifying. Now I'm super curious. Hades Town excluded can't be your answer. Out of your extensive Broadway resume, what would you say was your favorite role you've played? I think probably Valentina in Casa Valentina. Okay. Because she was so difficult to find and I didn't, I didn't find her for a long time. In fact, I think I did all the previews and even the first week or two of performances without ever really having felt like I found the groove. So mm -hmm. that was that was a long journey. I got to work with a great, great director, Joe Mantello, and extraordinary acting partners in that show. Well, now let's go back to Hades Town. I think it's more relevant than ever today. What would you say, as someone who lives the story every single night, say the commanding message of Hades Town is, and most importantly, why it's more relevant than ever? The theme, I'll call it the theme that you're talking about, is, um, is that you can make a difference. I think, and that love finally is what makes you strong enough to make a difference. And I feel like because of these times we live in, which are so troubled, Mm -hmm. um, I mean, my goodness, I, I imagine the, the kids growing up now going to school and thinking school is a place where you get shot mm -hmm. and uh, leaders trying to turn people against one another to say there are people out there on the other side of the wall who are dangerous to you. I'll keep you safe on this side of the wall. It must be a terrifying time to grow up. So a voice like Aeneas is that's saying, okay, that's a lot of noise and that all is happening, but you you can you can change it. There are a lot of young people who watch the show, right? And they look at performers like you who have a substantial resume spanning 20 years. How have you, as Patrick, persisted in one of the hardest industries on earth for so long and successfully? What advice would you give? I'd say make work. You know, what I've, what I've done when I don't have work is make some. You know, there's that wonderful quote by Goethe, which says, whatever uh, you can do or dream you can do, begin it. Mm -hmm. Boldness has a genius and a magic in it. Just start, just start. So before you leave today, it is time for my favorite segment of the show. It's time for a segment we like to call, Get Your Ass There. Here at the Marquee Channel, we support the arts and as a member of the community, we want you to take 45 seconds to tell the audience at home something they have to go out right now and see. The only condition is it can't be anything you're involved with. I loved this recent production of Oklahoma. Mm -hmm. I just loved it. I loved because to me, it didn't seem like anybody was doing anything disrespectful. It seemed like an excavation of that material where at every moment they were asking, what's this really about? I love that. Well, Patrick, thank you so much for um, hanging out with me today. Finally, I found someone with a lower voice than mine. Um, and I'm, I'm so glad we finally um, were able to connect. Um, if you want to see Patrick's performance in Hadestown on Broadway, be sure to purchase tickets available now at hadestown.com.
marquee.com. And as always, be sure that you're following the Marquee channel on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, at Marquee channel, but most importantly, press that subscribe button right on down there. Until next time, I'm Tyler reminding you to give love.